Okay, we're live. Okay, so we're running. It's a little bit choppy. Okay, not receiving enough video to maintain smooth streaming. Okay, as long as the sound works, this you know the 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 video I'm not as concerned about. Yeah, usually the audio is fine. It's just the video that's all choppy. The sound also. No, not usually. Okay. Okay, so One other thing we need to do is uh, we need to bring up the PowerPoint. Okay, I think we're happening. So we started about 1050 ish. 1055-ish. Okay, I'm just um, trying to check, uh, get an idea how much time you have to chop off the front. Okay. Okay. Um, and let's see. We where's the full screen thingy? Oh. Where's the button to put this on full screen? Elisheva? You you are full screen. <laughs> no, I mean the presentation. F five. And I go. I need my glasses too. Yeah. Girls get dressed. There you go. Mom, we're live. We're live. All right. Okay. Shalom, Yafa. Um, we're so far. We seem to be on and running. Your screen is their screen. You've got half the toy service PowerPoint covered up, but it's on yeah. the chat. Yeah, but once, that's okay. I want to see what's on the chat. Okay. Um, as people, when or if people come in. And, uh, oh, please. Uh, yeah, what happened to my, my, uh, Oh, 
Okay. Are you any kind? Of, are you seeing a, a big delay? I'm not on YouTube. Oh, you're not. Okay. Let me check though. Um. Let's see. My uh. My briefcase, my delete, my briefcase is not here. Yeah, it's probably in the room. Okay. All right. Um, okay, it's eleven oh one. We'll give it a few more minutes to see who uh, manages to make it in. There's a few minute delay. How much? Like three. Three minutes. <laughs> Well, that's how long it took you to go from live on OBS to YouTube. What? Better than 30 minutes. Yeah. yeah, three minutes is still awfully long, but it's... Well, at least we can survive today, even with the three-minute delay. Okay, so let's see, it's about 11.03 right now. Let's see how long it takes for you to get this. Uh, For the for the really? Mm -hmm. Maybe we can get started because there is a delay, and that will be continuous for them. Yeah. Yeah, it's better not to wait. Just get started. Uh, 
Because so far, the only person who's who's gone on and checked in is Yafa. I think we just have to. Dex. And she just put the uh, link up on Facebook. Dex people, my daughter is down. Okay, 11.05. I'm just tracking the time to see how long our delay actually is. The moment will be instant, so there's not much we can do on our side. Yeah. Um, yeah, we may have to modify our approach. What did Apti say? What's that? What did Apti say? Well, if it's uh, if it's starting, if they're getting the sound and the, the video three minutes late. They're uh, getting it three minutes from us, but to them it's instant. Yeah, that, what, but I'm, yeah, three minutes, but it's a three minute difference. So... Just put it up, and that way they can yeah just start follow it through. through. Then keep waiting, and it just okay. Um, okay, then let's let's go ahead and get started, and people will come in when they come in. She's not on the screen. It doesn't matter. Okay, let's go ahead and begin the prayer service, and um, God willing, it'll hold together this time. All right, here we go. Matovu halecha Yaakov, mishkanotecha Yisrael, va'ani berov chastecha avovetecha. Eshtacha be el hecha, el hecha kochecha, be iratecha. Adonai ahavti meon betecha, umekom mishkan kevodecha. Vani eshtacha ve vechra. Evracha, Evracha, Lifne Adonai Osi, Vanifti Lati Lecha Adonai, Et Ratzon, Elohim Berov Chastecha, Aneni Be'emet Ishecha. And Moses went up to God, and the Lord called to him from the mountain, saying, Thus shall you say to the house of Jacob, and tell the people of Israel, You have seen what I did to the Egyptians, and how I carried you on eagles' wings and brought you to myself. Now, therefore, if you will obey my voice indeed and keep my covenant, then you shall be my own treasure among all peoples, for all the earth is mine. And you shall be to me a kingdom of priests and a holy nation. These are the words which you shall speak to the people of Israel. And Moses came and called for the elders of the people and laid before their faces all these words which the Lord commanded him. And all the people answered together and said, All that the Lord has spoken we will do. And Moses returned the words of the people to the Lord. However, to those of you who are Gentiles, I say this, since I myself am an emissary sent to the Gentiles and make known the importance of my work in the hope that somehow I may provoke some of my own people to jealousy and save some of them. For if their casting Yeshua aside means reconciliation for the world, what will their accepting him mean? It will be life from the dead. Now if the challah offered as first fruits is holy, so is the whole loaf. And if the root is holy, so are the branches. But if some of the branches were broken off, and you, a wild olive, were grafted in among them, and have become equal shares in the rich root of the olive tree, then don't boast as if you were better than the branches. However, if you do boast, remember that you are not supporting the root, the root is supporting you. Okay, please rise. Mm -hmm. 
Baruch et Adonai HaMavorach Baruch Adonai HaMavorach Le'olam Vayed In days gone by, God spoke in many and varied ways to the fathers through the prophets. But now in the last days, he has spoken to us through his Son, to whom he has given ownership of everything, and through whom he created the universe. This sun is the radiation of the presence, radiance of the presence, the very expression of God's essence, upholding all that exists by his powerful word. And after that, he through himself made purification for sins. He sat down at the right hand of the greatness in the highest. Baruch Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, asher natan lanu derech ha-Yeshua, v'mashiach Yeshua. Shema Yisrael, Adonai Eloheinu, Adonai Echad. Baruch Shem Tevo, Malachuto, Le'olam Ve'ahavta et Adonai Elohecha, v'chol levavcha, v'chol nashecha, v'chol meodecha. Ve'hayu haverim ha'ele, asher anochi metzavcha, hayom alevavecha. V'shinatam levanecha v'dibarta bam, v'shibtecha v'vechtecha u'vlechtecha v'aderech, u'shachbecha u'vkumecha. V'shaltam le'ot al yodecha, ve'hayu letotafo v'en inecha. U'tatam amezuzot v'techa u'vishorecha. And it will come to pass that if you continually hearken to my commandments that I command you today, to love the Lord your God and to serve him with all your heart and with all your soul, then I will provide, provide grain for your land in its proper time, the early and late rains, that you may gather in your grain, your wine, and your oil. I will provide grass in your field for your cattle, and you will eat and be satisfied. Beware lest your heart be seduced and you turn astray and serve gods of others and bow to them. Then the wrath of the Lord will blaze against you. He will restrain the heavens so there will be no rain, and the ground will not yield its produce. And you will swiftly be banished from the goodly land which the Lord gives you. Place these words upon your heart and upon your soul, and them for a sign upon your hand, and let them be as guides between your eyes. Teach them to your children to discuss them while you sit in your home, while you walk on the road, when you lie down, and when you rise up. And write them on the doorposts of your house and upon your gates. To prolong your days and the days of your children in the land which the Lord has sworn to your ancestors to give them, like the days of heaven on the earth. And the Lord said to Moses, saying, Speak to the children of Israel and say to them that they are to make themselves seat seat on the corners of their garments throughout their generations. And they are to place upon the seat seat of each corner a thread of azure. And it shall constitute seat seat for you that you may see it and remember all the commandments of the Lord and perform them and not explore after your heart and after your eyes after which you stray so that you may remember and perform all my commandments and be holy to your God. I am the Lord your God who has removed you from the land of Egypt to be a God to you. I am the Lord your God. Okay. Um, you may be seated. And um, if we can, uh, there we are. Uh, I understand that we're on a three-minute delay at this point, so this might be a little difficult to do. Uh, but um, anything you want to type in in the way of prayer requests or yes. praise reports? Do you want to type in? What's that? Type in. Um, yeah, actually. Good idea. Okay. So, you may see see my uh, mention on chat uh, prayer requests or uh, praise reports. Um, it's okay when, uh, 
at least it's only a three minute delay rather than a 30 minute delay. <laughs> um, let's see, any praise reports? Let's see. Um, Abigail has her final week of school next week. This is this is uh, good and and not so good because uh, she uh, you know we she didn't get to have a proper ending to her, her school year her school uh, her senior graduation and stuff so we'll uh, yeah, pray that she uh, adapts and get used to it um, you know, be able to cope with uh, any trouble. The good news though is that uh, she's been breaking the rules. <laughs> Uh, they, you know, people have had birthdays, and they did what's called a drive-by birthday, where people get in their cars and they drive by and hoot and holler and yell as they drive by the person's house. Um, of course, the last couple times they did that, they all got out of the cars and just hung out anyway. So, um, so uh, they're trying. You're getting some sort of semblance of normal. And yesterday we did one, and it was a pretty big blowout. So it was good. It's good, you know. Um, let's see other uh, praise reports. Uh, went and saw my doctor, my eye doctor. Okay, this is this is if you're seeing me in the in the camera, you all explain this. The doctor gave me uh, good news that my eyes are coming along well, but they still have uh, more to go. My left eye is in better condition than my right eye. Um, and yesterday he uh, uh, put more shots in my behind my eye actually in, in the retina area um, with the net result of right now things are really fuzzy looking so if I if I'm squinting and trying to get figure out a, a position on my trifocals that I can actually read this reasonably well NT, Linda says praise looks like things are heading back to normal Yes. To pray for a new job for Ken quickly, that his boss changes his mind and co opens back up. Oh, okay, yeah. Um, and Auntie Kelly says, a praise looks like the CVD tests on my aunt were false positives, so they might let her out of quarantine too. Oh, excellent. Yeah, hopefully they uh, they dumped all those uh, Chinese ones they sent over that has the, the virus in it. Um. So, it's good news. Auntie Barbara said, I'm getting a uh, quote-unquote new used car on Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Well, may it last you a good long time and may you be very pleased with it. Um, okay, anything else? Uh, just pray that my for my eyes that it's um, very fuzzy right now. Uh, and it's... Uh, Usually, uh, usually I have my visit with the doctor on Thursday, so by the time Sabbath rolls around, my eyes have recovered enough to where I can get back to a new normal of improvement. But uh, things are still a little uh, wonky um, right now, so I'm, I'm having a real fun time trying to, to read things. Um, so, um, let's see, praise reports. Ellie Shave already finished her school year. And... Um, See anything else? Praise reports, prayer requests. Um, okay, I, I, we're still on about a three-minute delay. I don't know. Don't know. Okay. Um, assuming that, uh, let's uh, let's go ahead and continue to put on your on the prayer. On the on the uh, chat, you know, uh, praise reports and prayer requests. Otherwise, I want to move on and get to the uh, the prayer service. This is the first time in a couple of weeks we've actually been able to get this to pull off correctly, and um, and so uh, we're pretty. I'm pretty happy that we're we're making this work, uh, even though there's a uh, much longer than there should be. So at this point, it's just a, a hopefully it's a matter of tweaking the system to where it gets better than uh, than it is when uh, um, before when we just couldn't get it to work. So, anyways, um, let's go ahead and begin the. Uh, oh, so sorry. Just got to prayer list. Just got to prayer list. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so we're still running a few minutes late, but that's okay. Um, 
there we are. Um, so you guys will catch up, and um, um, I'll try to catch up to the items on the prayer list or other comments uh, when we get uh, to the other end of the prayer service. Okay, uh, let's all rise and face east, and we'll begin the Amidah. Adonai Svatai Tiftach Ufi Agit Tehilatecha Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Velohe Avoteinu Elohe Avraham Elohe Yitzhak Velohe Yaakov Ha'el Hagadol Hagibor Vehanora El Elyon Gomel Chasadim Tovim Vekone hako, vezoche chaste avot, umevi go el ivne bne en le man shemo behava, melechose u moshia u magen, barucha taronai, magen avraham, atagi borle olam aronai, Mechaye metim ata, rav lehoshia, morid hatal. Mechakel chaim bechesed, mechaye metim berachamim rabim. So mech no flim urofe cholim, umatir asurim. Umekayem emunato lishene afar. Micha mocha baal gevurot umido melach. Melech memit umekaye umats miach yeshua. Venemanata lechayot meitim. Baruch Adonai, Mechaye HaMeitim. Ata Kadosh Veshimcha Kadosh, Vekodashim Bechol Yom Halalucha. Ki Melech Gadol Vekadosh Ata, Baruch Adonai, HaEl HaKadosh. We will sanctify you and revere you according to the pleasant words of the Council of the Holy Seraphim, who thrice recite holy before you, as written by your prophets, as one angel called another and said, Kadosh, 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 Adonai Tzevaot, Meloko Haaretz Vekodo. Then with a sound of great noise, mighty and powerful, they make heard a voice, raising themselves toward the seraphim. Facing them, they give praise, saying, Baruch Evod Adonai, Mim Komo. From your place, our king, you will appear and reign over us, for we await you. When do you reign in Zion? Soon in our days, forever and ever, may you dwell there. <clears throat> may you be exalted and sanctified within Jerusalem, your city, from generation to generation and for all eternity. May our eyes see your kingdom as it is expressed in the songs of your might, written by David, your righteous anointed. Yimloch Adonai le'olam, Elohaich Sion le'dor vador, hallelujah. Moses rejoiced in the gift of his portion, that you called him the faithful servant. A crown of splendor you placed on his head when he stood before you on Mount Sinai. He brought down two stone tablets in his hand, on which is inscribed the observance of the Shabbat. So it is written in your Torah. Vishamru v'nei Yisrael et ha-Shabbat la-sod et ha-Shabbat l'dortam brit olam. Vishamru v'nei Yisrael et ha-Shabbat la-sod et ha-Shabbat l'dortam brit olam. V'nei v'n v'nei Yisrael ot hi le-olam, ot hi le-olam, ot hi le-olam. Le'olam ve'shamru v'nei Yisrael et ha-Shabbat la'asod et ha-Shabbat l'dor tamrit olam. Ki sheshet yamim asa Adonai, asa Adonai et ha-Shamayim 
ואת הארץ, ושמרו בני ישראל את השבת, לעשות את השבת לדורת הברית עולם. וביום השביעי, שבת ואין נפש, שבת ואין נפש, וביום השביעי, ושמרו בני ישראל את השבת, לעשות את השבת לדורתם ברית עולם. Then Yeshua said to them, Shabbat was made for mankind, not mankind for Shabbat. So mankind is Lord even of Shabbat. You did not give it, O Lord our God, to be the sign of the unbelieving nations of the lands, nor did you make it the inheritance, our King, of the worshippers of graven idols. For in its contentment the uncircumcised of the heart shall not abide, but to Israel, your people, the circumcised of the heart among Jews and Gentiles. Have you given it in love to the seed of Jacob and Messiah, whom you have chosen? They shall rejoice in your kingship, those who observe the Shabbat and call it a delight. The people that sanctifies the seventh day, they will all be satisfied and delighted from your goodness. In the seventh day, you found favor in it and sanctified it. First among the holy days, you called it a remembrance of the act of creation, our freedom from slavery, and our redemption through Messiah Yeshua. Our God and the God of our forefathers, may you be pleased now with our rest. Redeem us with Yeshua's sacrifice, sanctify us with your commandments, and grant us your share in your Torah. Satisfy us from your goodness and gladden our souls with your salvation. Bestow upon us your spirit to purify our hearts and to serve you sincerely. O Lord our God, with love and favor, grant us your holy Sabbath as a heritage. And may all of Israel, Jews and engrafted Gentiles, the sanctifiers of your name, rest from all our labors on it. Blessed are you, Lord, who sanctifies the Sabbath. Be favorable, O Lord our God, toward your people Israel. Turn to their prayer and restore the service to the Holy of Holies of your temple. Speedily accept the fire offerings of Israel and their prayer with love and favor. May the service of your people Israel always be favorable to you. May our eyes behold your return to Zion in compassion. Blessed are you, O Lord, who restores his presence to Zion. We gratefully thank you, for it is you who are the Lord, our God and God of our forefathers for all eternity. Our rock, the rock of our lives, shield of our salvation are you from generation to generation. We shall thank you and relate your praise for our lives which are committed to your power and for our souls that are entrusted to you. For your children that are with us every day and for your wonders and favors in every season, evening, morning, and afternoon. The beneficent one for your compassions were never exhausted and the compassionate one for your kindness has never ended. For we have always put our hope in you. For all these may your name be blessed, exalted, and extolled, our King continually forever and ever. Everything alive will gratefully acknowledge you and praise and bless your great name sincerely forever, for it is good. For all these, sorry, for our God of our salvation and help, the beneficent God. Blessed are you, O Lord, your name is the beneficent one, and to you it is fitting to give thanks. Establish peace, goodness, blessing, life, graciousness, kindness, and compassion upon us and upon all of your people, Israel. Barchenu avinu kulanu keechad, kulanu keechad beor panecha. Barchenu avinu kulanu keechad, kulanu keechad beor for the light of your countenance you gave us, O Lord our God, the Torah of life, in love of kindness, righteousness, blessing, compassion, life, and peace. And may it be good in your eyes to bless us and to bless all of your people, Israel, in every season and in every hour with your peace. Blessed are you, O Lord, who blesses his people, Israel, with peace. May the expressions of my mouth and the thoughts of my heart find favor before you, O Lord, my rock and my redeemer. My God, guard my tongue from evil and my lips from speaking deceitfully. To those who curse me, may my soul be silent and that my soul be like dust to everyone. As for all those who oppose and who design evil against me, speedily nullify their counsel and disrupt their design. May it be your will, O Lord my God and the God of my forefathers, that human jealousy may not rise up against me, nor my jealousy upon others. May I not become angry today and may I not anger you. 
Rescue me from the evil inclination and place in my heart submissiveness and humility. Open my heart to do your Torah, let my soul pursue your commandments. O our King and our God, cause your name to be sanctified in your world. Rebuild your city, lay the foundation of your house, perfect your sanctuary, gather in your scattered exiles, redeem your sheep through Yeshua's sacrifice, and gladden your congregation with your spirit. Act for your name's sake, act for your Torah's sake, act for your sanctity's sake, that your beloved ones may be given rest, let your right hand save and respond to me. In the expressions of my mouth, thoughts of my heart, find favor before you, O Lord, my rock and my redeemer. He who makes peace in his heights, may he make peace upon us and upon all Israel. Now respond. Amen. May it be your will, O Lord our God and the God of our forefathers, that the temple be rebuilt speedily in our days. Grant us our share in your Torah, and may we serve you there with reverence, as in days of old and in former years. Then the offering of Judah and Jerusalem will be pleasing to the Lord, as in days of old and in former years. Ve'alma divrach irute, ve'yam lich malchute, ve'chaye chon uv'yome chon, uv'chaye dechol bet Yisrael. Ba'gala, ba'gala, uv'izman kari, ve'imru, amen. Yehesh me'raba me'varach, ve'alam ula me'almaya yitvarach. Yitbarak, vichtabak, vitpavri, oman, vitnase, vithada, vitale, vithala, shme kudasha, brichu, leila, min kobechata, vishirata, tushbechata, venechemata, damiran, beyama, vimru, amen. Okay. We can. Uh... Only a two-minute delay. So Only a two-minute delay. Hey, that's better. We're catching up. Okay. Um, let's see. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. Okay. Been told we have a two minute delay, so that's uh, not as bad as three. Maybe we keep going long enough, uh, maybe we'll catch up to uh, just a few seconds. There's normally a few second delay just because of all the electronic stuff that has to happen, but uh, um, you know, compared to uh, you know, a couple weeks back where we you know, covered about a half an hour of material and three hours of waiting, uh, this is definitely a big improvement. So, um, so if you have anything in mind in, in way of a devar, uh, a common theme in the readings. Um, see, what did we come up with last night when we were reading? It was uh, a couple. Of, we had a couple of themes going. Uh, one obviously is <laughs> sort of the regular theme all the time is obey God. And good things will happen. Mm -hmm. Don't obey God, and bad things will happen. Okay, um, and that's kind of normal. So um, that's sort of the regular thing. Anything else? Um, uh, feel free to, to uh, type it in uh, when you get the opportunity. They just got to it. What's that? They just got to it. Just got to it. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Yeah, we uh, got in and made some adjustments on the OBS, so it seems to be working a little bit better now. Um, as far as I know, you'd, you'd have to let me know if, if the is the video and the sound working well, or is it choppy or messy? I'm not saying anything. Okay, no one's complaining. This is a good thing. <laughs> Okay, trust in Hashem's faithfulness. Yes. Um, 
I really was, I, I'm always impressed each, each year reading this, that God would uh, specify, especially on the Jubilee years, where you have two years of not planting and growing commercially, that uh, God promises that your food stores will last not just uh, through the seventh year, the Sabbath year, but through the eighth year, the Jubilee year, and even into the ninth year until the new harvest comes in. Um, and I'm always impressed with that. You know, I, I, you know, God obviously knew that he's going to be asking a lot of us to trust that we're going to be able to go, you know, into the third year with not, without having any commercial uh, agriculture going on. Um, and still still have enough food and, and to get along. So uh, it's kind of nice that he throws that in there and explains it in, in such clear detail that you know all we have to do is trust. The, the sad news, on the other hand, is that you know we had a 70-year exile from the land because during the entire time that Israel possessed the land, they never did actually obey the uh, sabbatical year. Uh, the sabbatical years and the jubilees, so um, that's really kind of kind of sad. So uh, may we, uh, you know, may we live with greater faithfulness. Uh, okay, let's see if I can read this. Um, George, Shabbat Shalom. Okay, Shabbat Shalom, George. Uh, Joyce, good to have you on. Shalom, essence of rest in his kingdom. Okay, yeah. God promises you walk in his ways. He gives you peace with your neighbors. They're going to be afraid to mess with you. This is sort of a, you know, the, the answer is plain and obvious, although it's not as, you don't necessarily always think of it immediately because God promises that, when you follow his ways, he, he gives the rain to the land. You grow lots of food. Uh, then you uh, you get to have, um, uh, you know, uh, you have more food. You have bigger families. You have a larger population. You have a stronger economy and a stronger army. People are not going to want to mess with you. Um, you know, if you disobey God and the rain doesn't come, as a result, then you get less food, you have smaller families, you have a smaller economy, you have a smaller army, and people think, hmm, we can take them. So the, the, the bottom line then is, you know, obey God, and not only are you going to have good, peaceful lives, um, but, you know, the enemies are people that would normally think about attacking you aren't. So... Yeah, Barbara says, Shabbat for the land is not to be neglected. Yeah, that is absolutely true. And even though there are some, there are some, there's some effort in Israel to uh, have a sabbatical year for the, for the farmers, it hasn't really caught on. It hasn't caught on yet. It hasn't caught on that well. So I just need to continue to pray that God would cause, you know, hearts and minds to, uh, to trust to trust. This is definitely a big statement, but uh, I think the last night I, uh, I mentioned, you know, for for was it really that big a step for Israel to think that God can provide to make the food last for uh, a, a year without any agribusiness um, on the regular Sabbath year and even last into the third year if you have a, a two years out because of the Jubilee, the Yovel. Um, and, you know, it, it kind of dawned on me last night, okay, so what's going on with their agribusiness right here at this time? You know, every morning they get they get the man. The man ends up on the, on the ground. Every evening you have quail um, coming. Um, so... The children of Israel should have been already prepared uh, to accept the idea that God will miraculously provide. See if I can catch up on the. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, 
if uh, Haftarah trust his pe trust his people will be returned to the land. Bridachadasha trust in his plan of uniting his uh, his people to himself. All Israel will be saved. Yeah. And remember, the definition of Israel is Jew and Gentile who belong to, to Messiah. Okay, and Joyce, Psalm 25, 1, the earth is the Lord's and... Oh, yeah, we are not permanent. <laughs> yeah, we, we, have a, we have another place to go to when this is over. Okay. Anything else in the way of... Um, Comment on, on the Devar. Earlier, Antila just said that Torah portion is to rely on Hashem to provide food and food. Did I miss that? Mm -hmm. oh. That's okay. Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go ahead. Um, let's go ahead and get started with the um, continuation of the prayer service. And... Um, you guys will catch up as you catch up. Okay, let's move on. Uh, let's go. Let's pass up the chance. We don't have the Torah to. Um, okay, back up to the uh, Torah. Torah blessings. Torah blessings. Yeah, that's after there. Here we are. Baruch Adonai. Wrong blessing. Baruch Adonai. Have a vote. Have a vote. I am so messed up with this one now. Baruch Adonai Marach Marach Leolam Vaed. Baruch Adonai Marach Leolam Vaed. Baruch Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam. Asher Bachar Banu Michol Hamin Ben Hatan Lanu. Baruch Adonai. Baruch Adonai. No Tain Hatorah. Amen. Give me a couple weeks off and I just completely fall apart. <laughs> okay, let's, um, where is our, um, somewhere around here should be. The the reading calendar. Somewhere should be our, um, I put up. Um, I don't see it here. Wait, hold on. I, I know you put it up, but there's a different way. Aha! There we are. So small. Okay. Uh, actually, let's, let's zoom on to uh, the seventh Parsha. No, sorry. Seventh part. <laughs> Thank you. Um, the seventh part? Yeah, uh, so scroll on down. Here. Yeah, just keep going to you. You'll see the little Roman numeral seven. What? I should have said it there. This is two. Keep going. Oh, Got a long okay. ways to go. I know what you mean. So good. Yeah. Bye. Five. Five. Six. six. Right about yeah. there. Okay. If a foreigner living with you, this, by the way, is uh, uh, Vaikra. This is. Um, uh, was it 20? Uh, how quickly I forget. Yeah, 25. <laughs> 25, verse 47. If a foreigner living with you has grown rich and a member of your people has become poor, um, and sells himself to this foreigner living with you or to a member of the foreigner's family. He may be redeemed after he has been sold. Um, one of his brothers may redeem him, or his uncle or his uncle's son may redeem him, or any near relative of his may redeem him, or if he becomes rich, he may redeem himself. He will calculate with the person who bought him the time to the year of Yovel and the amount of uh, to be paid will be according to the number of years and his time at the at the employees at an employee's wage. 
If many years remain, according to them, he will refund the amount for his redemption from the amount he has bought. He was bought for. If there remains only a few years until the the year of Yovel, then he will calculate with him according to the years. Will he refund the amount for his redemption? He will be like a worker hired by the year, but hired year by year. You will see to it that he is not treated harshly. Okay. If he has not been redeemed by any of these procedures, nonetheless he will go free in the year of Yovel. He and his children with him. And then the Moftir portion. For, uh, for to me the people of Israel are slaves. They are my slaves whom I brought out of the land of Egypt. I am Adonai, your God. That's the... Uh, oh, sorry. That's all of it? Okay. All right. As long as we're here, let's pull up the... Uh, can we do the... Uh, I have it um, here. Oh, yeah. oh, by the way, this is the end of the book, right? Mm -hmm. So what do we do at the end of the book? Chazak, chazak, venit chazek. Be strong and be strong. May we be strengthened. Amen. Okay. So uh, let's take a look at uh, Jeremiah. Yirmeyahu. Jeremiah 16. Uh, verses 19 to 17, 14. So Yirmiyahu 16. Are we doing more blessings? Uh, we could. I just. Oh. Baruch Atah Adonai Eloheinu Melech Haolam. Shek Shizan Barak Lidon Amin. Vilatananu Letorto. Baruch Atah Adonai. Noten HaTorah. Amen. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Um, Jeremiah, what was it? 18, 16. 16. 16. To 17. I know, I'm trying to find 6. Sorry. He's <laughs> <laughs> right after 5. Okay. 17. No, no, no. No, no, no. no. Okay. There. Thank you. We'll find it. I forgot. Hold on a minute. 19 to 17. Yeah. Okay. Talk now if we can go back to the uh, blessing before the uh, Haftarah. What is it? Is That's right. Next. Okay. Yeah. There you go. There we go. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, Asher b'chabam, b'nvoyim tovim, B'ratza divrehem, anemarim be'emet. Baruch atah Adonai, Abocher ha-Torah, U'moshe avdo, U'b'Yisrael amo, U'b'ye ha-emet v'atzedek. Amen. Okay. Okay, we are in uh, Sefer Yirmiyahu, uh, Jeremiah the prophet, chapter 16, verse 19, and then continuing to 17, 14. 17, 14. Okay. Adonai, my strength, my fortress, my refuge in time of trouble. The nations will come to you. From the, from the ends of the earth, saying, Our ancestors inherited nothing but lies, futile idols, completely useless. Can a person make himself gods? In fact, they aren't gods at all. Therefore, I will make them know, once and for all, I will make them know my power and my might, and then they will know that my name is Adonai. Yehuda's sin is written with an iron pen. With a diamond point, it is engraved on the tablet of their hearts, and on the on the horns uh, and on the horns of your altars. Uh, as they remember their children, so they remember their altars, and their sacred poles by the green trees on the high hills. My mountains in the field, um, your wealth and all your treasures will be plundered because of the sin of your high places throughout your territory. You will relinquish your hold on your heritage, which I gave you. 
I will make you serve your enemies in a land that you do not know. For you have kindled my fiery anger, and it will burn forever. Here is what Adonai says. A curse on the people who trust in humans, who relies on merely human strength, whose heart turns away from Adonai. He will be like a tamarisk in the Aravah. When relief comes, it is unaffected. For it lives in the sun, baked desert, in salty, uninhabited land. Pressed, uh, blessed is the man who trusts in Adonai. Adonai will be his security. He will be like a tree planted near water. It spreads out its roots by the river. It, uh, it does not notice when heat comes and its foliage is, is luxuriant. It is not anxious in a year of drought, but keeps on yielding fruit. The heart is more deceitful than anything else and mortally sick. Who can fathom it? I, Adonai, search the heart. I test inner motivations in order to give to everyone what his actions and conduct deserve. A partridge hatches eggs it did not lay. Like this, like this are those who get rich unjustly. In the prime of life, their wealth will desert them. In the end, they will prove to be fools. Throne of glory, exalted from the beginning. O our holy sanctuary, hope of Israel, Adonai, all who abandon you will be ashamed. Those who leave you will be inscribed in the dust because they have ab abandoned Adonai, the source of living water. Heal, heal me, Adonai, and I will be healed. Save me, and I will be saved. For you are my praise. That's it, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Back to our... Uh... Okay. Uh, about... Amen. Okay, then the Brita uh, Shab blessing. Oh, sorry. Yeah, uh, Matty Chow. Go ahead. Um, Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, asher natan lanu Mashiach Yeshua, v'had varim shel brit ha-chadasha, Baruch atah Adonai, motein v'had ha-chadasha, Amen. Okay, so it's, um, we're going to read the, the last portion, Matthew 22, 1 to 14. May I please type? May I please type? Was it 22? 22. 1 to 14. Yeah, so. Okay. Do I? What's that? Never mind. Okay. Yeshua again used parables in speaking to them. The kingdom of heaven is like a king who prepared a wedding feast for his son. But when he sent his, sla his slaves to summon the invited guests to the, to the wedding, they refused to come. So he sent some more slaves, instructing them to tell the guests, Look, I prepared my banquet, I slaughtered my bulls, my fatted calves, and everything is ready. Come to the wedding. But they weren't interested and went off, one to his farm, another to his business, and the rest um, grabbed his slaves, mistreated them, and killed them. The king was furious and sent his soldiers who killed those murderers and burned down their city. Then he said to, the, to his slaves, Well, the wedding feast is ready, but the ones who were invited didn't deserve it. So go out to the, to the street corners and invite to the banquet as many as you find. The slaves went out into the streets, gathered all the people they can find, the bad among with the, along with the good, and the wedding hall was filled with guests. Now when the king came in to look at the guests, he saw there was a, a man who wasn't dressed for a wedding. So he asked him, Friend, how did you get in here without wedding clothes? The man was speechless. Then the king said to, to the servants, Bind him hand and foot and throw him outside in the, in the dark. In that place people will wail and grind their teeth, for many are invited, but few are chosen. Okay. And this is uh, blessing after. Baruch atah Adonai, Eloheinu melech haolam, asher natan lanu devar emet, 
Vihaye olam nata betochenu, Baruch atarunai, no tain bridacharasha. Amen. Hey, we give you thanks and bless you, O Lord our God, for the, for, for the Torah, for the worship on this day, and for the prophets as well as for the Shabbat day. For Messiah Yeshua and for the renewed covenant, which you, O Lord our God, has given us for holiness and for rest, for glory and delight. Evermore may your name be continually praised by every living being. Blessed are you, Lord, who makes holy the Shabbat. May it be your will. Oops, we don't have a new month. Okay, let's go on to, um, let's do a don't long. You don't want to do the more Scottish? Let's do the Adon Olam. Okay. Oops, sorry. Okay. Adon Asher Malach Beterem Kol Yitzir Nivra Le'ed Nasa Vechev Zoko Azai Melech Shemo Nikra Ve'achare Kichlot Hakol Levado im loch nora, vehu haya, vehu hove, vehu ye beti fara, vehu echad, vein sheni, lehan shilo, lehach bira, beli reshit, beli tachli, velo ha oz, veha misra, vehu eli, Vechai goali, Betsur hevli, Beet Sara, Vehu nisi umanosli, Menat kosi, Beomekra, Beado, Afki ruhi, Beet ishan, Bea imra, Veim ruhi, Gaviati. Adonai li velo ira. Okay, let's go on to the uh, Birkata Kohanim. Please rise. Our God and God of our forefathers, bless us with a three-verse blessing in the Torah that was written by the hand of Moses, your servant. That is said by... Aaron and his sons, the Kohanim, your holy people, as it is said. Yevarech Harunai Veishmerecha Amen. Can you hear that song? Ya Eronai Peninalecha Vichunecha Amen. Can you hear that song? Yisarunai penin alecha Vesem lecha shalom Amen. Can you hear that song? The Lord will bless you and safeguard you. The Lord will look upon you and dote over you. The Lord will turn to you and appoint to you peace. Veshem Yeshua Moishinu. Shabbat Shalom. Shabbat shalom. Okay. Let's get back to the chat box, please. Yes, sir. Okay. It'll be, I guess, a couple minutes until... Oops. Still a couple minutes until you're done. So I'm going to hang on just a little bit. In case uh, you have any uh, questions, comments, or uh, rebukes to get started early, we are going to um, shut this video off, this particular session. Then we will restart a new one so we can do the um, um, do the uh, bulletin and the um, and the uh, parsha discussion separately. That way. Um, that way, whoever wants the prayer service can go straight to the prayer service, and whoever wants the uh, discussion can go straight to the discussion. Okay, so um, hang on just a little bit further, and um, we just got onto the um, the uh, benediction. Okay, so. Um,
Yeah, Avigail says uh, the uh, uh, beer catacomb is just getting started on on the delay. So um, that isn't too horribly bad. We we've we've done worse <laughs> as far as delays go. Um, okay, let me uh, do this. Um, so about the time you get to the end of the prayer service, be about the time I'm going to shut things down. And then uh, give me a few minutes. Um, Yafa will be able to post the link once we get the 